Welcome to another Spreadsheeters video guide. You can find written instructions for these steps on the Spreadsheeters website. In this video, we're going to see how to change the numbers on the x-axis in Excel. Charts are a great way to visualize data, and Excel provides a number of charts that you can create and many options to format them. The type of chart you create depends on the underlying data set. Having created a chart, you may want to change the numbers on the x-axis. There are two ways of doing this. The first is to change the underlying data set. In this example, I have a chart where I've got years listed on the x-axis and I want to change these. So to do that, I can change the underlying data set. So I'm going to change it to just year one, year two. And as you can see, while I'm typing these values, the values in the chart are changing simultaneously. I can then just drag this down since I've created a sequence and you can see that the chart has been updated. The numbers on the x-axis have changed. So this is one way of doing it. Now I will press Control z to undo these changes and let's look at the second way where you want to change the numbers but you don't want to change the underlying data set. So to do this, select the chart and on the chart design menu go to select data. In this box, go to the horizontal X uh, axis labels section and click on edit. Now here you can, I can type the values separated by commas. So this will also update the labels. This is a way of customizing the axis labels. Of course, uh, typing, if you have a lot of values, it takes a bit of time to type them. You could also just refer to a range of values, but that uh, becomes a bit complicated because you may accidentally delete that range without knowing that it refers to the axis labels. So that having been done, you can just say OK. And you can see that in the data source box, the years, the series has been updated. So now we can say OK. And you can see that the numbers have changed on the x-axis in the chart. So these are two ways in which you can change the numbers on the x-axis in Excel. Please read the appended article for further guidance. 